I believe in healthcare as a human right, and technology has the potential to give this basic right to every one of us. Blindness is common and it's disabling to an individual. A blind individual can disrupt an entire social network. There are more than 285 million people suffering from preventable eye disease. These figures suggest that although modern retinal equipment can provide good quality diagnostic images, something is wrong. The retina is the back of the eye, and to see it, you've got to see through the pupil. And it's like trying to see the world through a keyhole. The eye is also a living camera, and it's really hard to take an image of an imaging system. Current precision equipment is large, bulky, expensive, and requires sophisticated technical training to operate. There is no one device that solves all these problems until now. We have built a new class of retinal diagnostic imaging system using light field technology. In fact, light fields is the way we see the world around us. A normal camera is fixed in space for a single shot. So when I see you, I see one view of you. When there are two cameras, like our eyes, there's a difference between the views that allows us to see depth. Now, imagine I am lots of cameras, 2,400 in this case, and this is the number of images we are capturing off the retina, and all this using a single shot. This allows us to adjust focus after we take an imaging image, meaning anyone can take a precise diagnostic image. We offer better quality images by removing glare, because if there's an obstacle, I can choose my views and look around. We offer new diagnostic features that no other retinal imaging device offers by creating 3D depth maps and metric measurements of the retinal features. And this is patient-specific. The optics is simple but robust, making it perfectly portable. And all these features without dilating the eye. This new device has been named the retinal plenoptoscope. Ultimately, with machine learning algorithms, we will be able to provide precise diagnosis in countries where there's no access to medical care. When successful, we will have global reach in decreasing blindness. I'm Anjali from the Australian Centre for Robotic Vision at QUT, and we hope to change the way we see our eyes so we never have to stop experiencing life through vision. Thank you. Thank you.